Okay, so I've just popped into the bar for just a quick refreshing drink. And who did I pop in and see? A few of these guys all here. Look at these familiar faces. We've got Pixie with us. How are you doing, Pixie? Good, thank you. Great to see you. We've got Hattie. Hello, Hattie. Hi, okay. Um, and hello there, Julian. How are you today? Well, I'm Julian and I'm an alcoholic. <laughs> and we're loving the hair with Matthew. How are you, Matthew? I'm okay. You good? Uh, yeah, it's not too bad. It's been a great day, actually, hasn't it? Have you found the um, DaleCon 3 today? Has it been for you, Hattie? Yeah, it's good, yeah. First time in, where is it, Will? <laughs> Rochdale. In Rochdale. Yeah, yeah it's the first time. Oh. Return of the yeah. Jedi in Rochdale. Just joking, yeah. It's the first time I've been here. It's, uh, yeah, good convention. It's fun. In a football stadium, which is pretty good. Brilliant. What's it been like meeting your fans? Do you come to these quite regular, Julian? Um, yeah, I'm fairly new to the convention scene, but um, I've had a busy year. I, I do them about once a fortnight, so... And uh, as I'm a complete nerd myself, I'm quite at home at conventions. And uh, yeah, I mean, I'm enjoying them. I think they're awesome. Brilliant. Have you been finding it, Matthew? Has it been good for you? Has it been nice meeting some of your fans and wanting to have pictures taken and things? Yes, definitely. And a lot of them will basically want to phone my long. as well yeah, no. so Matthew Doctor Who tell us about it obviously was you a massive fan before you got into it how did it all come about for you yes basically um, I've been a big Doctor Who fan since well ages ago my um, first um, encounter with Doctor Who was meeting Sylvester McCoy he came to see my, my local amateur production um, hometown in Dorchester and since then I've basically wanted to be in, um, wanted to be a Doctor Who see Doctor Who meet everyone and now I'm here and basically, I love it. And basically, I got by my agency, who gave me a call saying, Will I do it? And I said, Yes. They wouldn't tell me what I was going to do until last minute. But when I found out, I was like jumping up and down with excitement, as you do, but with clothes on, but without, but definitely with clothes on. <laughs> Hattie, Craig Charles, working with him. How has that been for you? Well, it's good you worked with him on Robot Wars. So, you know, he's, um, he's very like his character in Lister, actually. One time when he was complaining about being a slob about them casting him as a slob and, uh, and they said well, well yeah, that's kind of what you're like Craig and he went no I'm not and then just licked his plate clean <laughs> so they went oh yes that's what you are like so yeah and he's a laugh and it's great Fab. Julian Game of Thrones even though you said that he was never in it before and we heard you saying that he did say that before and um, process what happened how did it come about did you send a photograph in like the girls no I, I'm not yet in Game of Thrones so uh, oh. It's, uh, it's one of them, but I've auditioned a couple of times and uh, I'm just waiting to see what happens. So I would like to be in Game of Thrones, and, uh, but I've been on uh, loads of other bits and pieces, but that one's yet yeah, escaping me. But there's always plenty of time for me to go in and do a couple of scenes and then be decapitated. So good, good Amazing, amazing. Um, Pixie, have you been, how long have you been in Game of Thrones now then? Um, I only did two episodes, so I did one in season three and one in season four. I'm shooting other things now. Fabulous. Well, there we go. It's been a nice chat. We've all been here at Rochdale for the return of the Jedi. And, guys, it's been great talking to you all. Um, and no doubt we'll be seeing you at more conventions. Yeah. Yeah. See you later.